what you do when the person pulls God okay so there's a few choice you can drop your knees and get stuck or you can prevent okay I'm gonna show you guys four ways to count and attack when the person pull God I'm gonna show you guys this way that way this way and that way short uh, four different ways for you to counting the guard pull okay so if you have a hard time please this video is for you to sharpen up your path okay so let's go into a concept and some drills in the end so stick around if you don't know me my name is Mark Tinoco Marcelo Garcia black belt big us all right let's jump into our lessons right here so we're gonna start right here okay so our first our first option is gonna be he pulls guard okay so whatever foot he goes here right he put his left foot here all I need to do is the inside knee goes over and I'm turning that way and now I don't have to change grip. I'm just gonna pull myself in, slide through it. Okay, so let's go again. So from here, move this way. He pulls guard. I turn in, my knee take care of his leg. Okay, my inside knee and my grip don't change. So that's gonna be the first pass, knee cut through it. But a lot of people are gonna say, oh Marcos, what happens if he pull guard with the other foot? Same idea, okay? So he goes here, number two, I turn, I counting the pass, and he won't expect that. And then from here, you get the side control, okay? So the number one, basically gonna go to your left, number two goes to your right, okay? So one more time, let's go into the first pull. I turn, pull myself in by the collar, and slide in. Number two, I go to the other side. Right away, I count the attack, and he won't accept, he won't expect that. That's the best part. Okay. So all right, let's move into our next one. Let's move quick to the next one. Next one, he's gonna be a little bit tight on me. Okay. So how I'm gonna break grips? I'm gonna go here. Whenever he pulls guard, same idea. Now don't pull, don't break grips. It's staying here because if I do a good job breaking here, breaking here, he can literally grab my leg and maybe go for the tripod sweep and get me in okay so when I break grips he's tight I'm gonna start moving back to put tension on his grip now when I'm breaking breaking now cross grip cross grip hit move around block and here I am in the north south okay so let's go again so let's go on this angle hit pull guard first thing first start moving back put tension on his grips Break one, two, cross grip, move around from far, and then from here goes into a north south position. Okay, I could go stay right there, Max. Lay down here. I could go from here, maybe he squared up. I'm moving back one, two. I always go here, cross grip, walk, pin this leg down, block the far leg, walk around, walk around, and here I am in the north south. Okay, so that's the beat number two. Okay, so now let's go into it. What you do on the pull guard, which is gonna be our number three, is gonna be uh, uh, over on the pass, which is a very good way to get over on the pass. Okay, so let's take a look. He pulls guard in the exact same way. He pull guard. Now, all I want you to do here is from here, I wanna block, I can break this grip or I can keep this grip block this leg, move back, pull this leg between my legs. Now these hands, if you guys can see it, I underhook, grab the belt. Now, you can stay here. Now I'm gonna drop on my knees and my inside, the outside shoulder goes here, look. There. Now, walk up, okay? Now from here, I'm nice and tight and over and under. Walk to the middle. So now if I try to take my leg out, he follows. What I wanna do it, I wanna sprawl, take my leg out, and now the deed that I like here is go under his arm. Now I wanna get under, get the collar. As you guys can see from here, set the grip, let go the hip, let go the collar, the, the legs, and then go side control, okay? Let's go on the other side. He pulls guard. I'm gonna go into your over under. He pull guard, grab the pants, put inside the leg, circle. Now my shoulder gonna go, my head gonna go here. 
okay? So I'm gonna go here, grab, drop to my knees to trap this leg. Now my shoulder gonna go here. Now come off your knees. Now I'm in a diagonal, I need to walk to the middle, look. Arm tight, walk, walk, sprawl, take my leg out, walk up a little bit, under his arm, grab the collar. Now when I secure the upper body grip, I let go the leg and establish right here. So that's the, the, what I like to do on the over on the pass. Works super, super well, okay? So let's go into our next one here. So the next one, he pull guard. So now I could go to uh, tapping his foot, okay? So for example, I could prevent that. So whatever foot he goes, I'm gonna block, circle around, okay? I could push, I could wipe it away. That could be really good options right here. So from here, he pulls guard, block, move around. And here I am. It's kind of like more of prevention than anything else. So if he, go, if he goes on the other foot, I'm here, block, take the foot out, get to side control. Those are work really, really well for, because one arm control the collar and one arm can push that way, and one arm can push the other way, works super well. Because the problem that I see is when the person pull guard, you let it settle and then work to, to uh, uh, and then start working again. So make sure you don't go on the knees. If you get a knee, it's gonna get stuck, okay? So that's gonna be super hard. All right, let's go into our drills, where the drill, super, e super easy, okay? So back here, Matt, you can lay down. Drill number one, you can literally go from here, cross grip, walk around, walk, here, back in the front, and then switch side. One, walk, boom, from the outside, right? So drill, you can do this for maybe two, one or two minutes. Now from here, he goes for the grips, right? So I'm gonna move to the side. He gonna use his foot on my hip. Now he's squared up, yes. And now I'm gonna move here, he's squared up. I'm gonna move to the other side, squared up, move to the other side. So that way I'm always keeping one knee in the middle so that way I can cut through it okay no matter the grips okay so you always slide through and then the detail go back here same thing side side for one or two minutes you can lay down now the next drill is going to be over under just connect hit boom back hit there boom wow boom just the entry back up so from here, I underhook and over. Go here, there. So that way you get used to, to the to the over on the entry. So those are the, the bits that I like to do. Those drills time super, super well your, your guard pass and your counting is gonna be amazing if you decide to use that to switch pass them one when they pull guard. So I recommend you to always prevent, <coughs> excuse me, prevent the person from getting tight on you, okay? So if you like this content and please subscribe, share the video, and please comment on the video what you do when they pull guard on you, okay? So thank you so much, big ups.